Okay. So, I recently heard about the uh, protests for Reddit on uh, the changing of the APIs, and uh, I guess there's certain subreddits that are, you know, protesting, some aren't, but basically, I'm not for or against it, but I have possibly figured out a way to get somewhat around it. So basically, um, you just have to uh, go to the... No, I don't <laughs> I don't want to go to Quora. But basically, you have to go to underneath where it has the actual um, URL. And uh, obviously, the one that's Reddit, well, here you go. You can just click the cached um, version of it. And as long as it's not been cached again during the protest, basically, you can still access whichever Reddit was normally um, under the protest. So, like, if you go, if you try to go to this regularly, oh, it's a private community, private protest, you know, can't go to it. So, you only get you know, your regular feed, or, well, I guess what would be available that's not a private community. So there is also another way around this. Um, Basically, if you know what community you're looking for, or, like, what you want to access, you just have to go to the Wayback Machine and put in the link. So I have not yet checked. Let me check this quick. Um, You can see at least the... uh, title of the post and uh, some of the content, like you can see videos, but that's an advertisement anyway for <laughs> for um, Reddit, so let me see. I don't want to load two of those. What if you could get dust from scrap and copper? Uh, also, story behind this, um, I recently just started uh, looking at Minecraft again. I have not played it and I don't even know how long, so I was curious to see if I could find answers for something, because I was interested in the amplified worlds for it, so yeah, anyway. This kind of gives you a little bit of access, but I feel like this is better. Like, if you you can find the thing you're looking for through this, then you can just go to the cached version of it. Um... I mean, I guess the same goes for websites that are, like, kind of broken. Uh, when you search them, like, maybe their search result will come up, but you cannot access it uh, normally, so you can just go to the cached version, and you can still see whatever was on the site or whatever. And actually, yeah, here, you can still see, like, two months ago, two months ago, one month ago, you can still see the posts that were here. Um in the cached version, you might, you know, honestly, you might be able to actually just get to, no, you cannot get to the regular version like that. Okay. But yeah. Anyway, for more specific posts, this works. If you really needed to get to the Reddit page, I guess you can do Wayback Machine, but you might be limited on what you can actually see there. But anyway, that, that, that's the video anyways. Uh, just, just thought it was... Something that would be useful, because, like, I don't know, for instance, if you're looking up, like, uh, I don't know, PC, no, 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 wait, RAM overclocking, because this is what I'm doing specifically. Let me see. Uh, I should do RAM overclocking Reddit, because maybe it's something that's under, um, protest. Oh, yep, this is a private community. Well, guess what? I can still access it with the cached version. See, that's that's the nice thing is like if you can find a specific post, you can just go on the cached version of it and you can still see everything that was posted. But yeah, anyway. Uh useful for me, so I thought it would be useful for everybody else. Uh that's it. Uh see ya.